It's time to sip another glass of Bel Air. It's time to roll up some of that, that cookie. What you doing? We hustling, what we doing? We grinding, what we doing? I'm live in the studio right now. And I mean right now with Definition. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definition is here, bro. Um, Man, what's popping, dog? Man, what's good, Matty? Chilling, dog. I'm happy you came through. Um, Shout out AZ's finest, bro. Facts. Uh, Making this happen, bro. Hyenas in the building. You know how it is, bro. What is Hyenas exactly, bro? Because I've been seeing that, dog. So Hyenas is a label that me and my brother, you feel me? Straight Hyenas, dog. The Hyena Mafia. We out, okay. you feel me, eating all and everything that we touch. It's uh, going crazy right now. A Hyena Mafia is a label. Mm-hmm. That's a label. The Hyena Mafia family, HMF. Okay, HMF. I like that. It has a ring to it. Is, uh, is there other artists signed to it, or is it just mm-hmm. you? No, nah, it's a bunch of us. So right now, it's about five of us strong, you know what I mean? But... We picking up and losing, we cutting off and doing what we got to do to make sure everybody is on the right track. And if you ain't on the right track, you out. You out. Okay, so there's five artists signed to the label. Females, guys? Nah, it's all dudes right now. All dudes. We had a few females, but they wasn't doing what they were supposed to they do. They were so. working the hyena way. They weren't yeah. hyenas, bro. They wasn't hyenas, so they got <laughs> eight. You, you need straight hyenas, bro. It's, it's a jungle exactly, out there, dog. You exactly. get eaten. <laughs> you ain't working, bro. If you ain't working, you ain't staying. <laughs> Straight up, bro. It would be dope to get a female artist, though. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's for sure what we're looking for. We've been already trying to put... We're trying to find a Vegas female artist because everybody okay. pretty much coming out of Vegas with the hyenas. So we looking for somebody that's really doing what they're supposed to do out here. The hyenas, like, I'm going to be in Vegas tomorrow, but the hyenas... They're uh they're coming from Vegas, bro. Yeah, yeah. I like that, bro. That's I love Vegas. At. Vegas one of my favorite places. Um actually I interviewed, do you know Adam Plant, the mm-hmm. big bodyguard, Floyd's bodyguard? He's from nah. Vegas, bro. He's always up there. Mm-mm. You born and raised in Vegas? No, no. I'm born in Riverside, California. I'm... LA to LV, my bad. Exactly, exactly. Okay. I spent a lot of time back and forth. Like half of my life in Los Angeles, half of my life in, in Vegas. So which one you like better? <sighs> I ain't no picking. It's just vacation for both. <laughs> okay, you can't get you can't get uh, you can't go wrong with either state, right? Nah, I've been living in. I spend two years in Vegas and then go spend three in Cali and then come right back to Vegas for three years and then now I'm right back in Cali for another three. So you're back in Cali. You could wind up back in Vegas. Fuck, you might even wind up here in Arizona. You don't know. Yeah, I actually just moved here a couple months ago, so this is like my new base home. You feel me? I'm trying to expand my variety a little bit as far as the people that know me nobody know me out here so i'm trying to change that okay so you pretty much you've really explored a lot of the west coast Mm -hmm. what do you think the biggest difference is and let's just compare vegas to cali because you just got here but at least the music scene bro vegas is different bro really different it's it's real different um as far as like the love that people show you know i mean it ain't the same in vegas as it is in california because i get all my shows booked in california even though i'm coming out of vegas you know what i mean you're getting booked more in cali than you are in vegas yeah for sure that's crazy bro because cali is saturated it's a saturated market exactly but once again most of my family is from california so you're plugged yeah i'm plugged i got a lot of people out there that know people and they want to see me out there versus vegas it's just me coming up on my own, so don't nobody show love out there. It's an ED world, so they're going to try to show love for who they know. They don't know me. I feel that, bro. I feel that, bro. How do you like living here in Arizona so far? I'm liking it. Everybody show love to me out here, especially because I'm fresh out here and I'm doing what I'm doing. Like I, You can't deny good music, you know what I mean? So Hell yeah, bro. <laughs> people you, see it. You actually dropped um, a tape this year. Yeah, this is my first project. 2021. Mm-hmm. You drop Definition Relapse. Yes, sir. Relapse. It's 11 on tracks on it, I think. Yep. Got a couple features, bro. Mm hmm. Name is uh, Autumn Features, is Hyena Mafia features. So, so. Larry Dove, mm-hmm. Spitter. Yep, Spitter the CEO. Spitter's the CEO. Mm hmm. And he got a feature on the track, on the, on the EP. Mm hmm. So, let's talk about the project, bro. Um, How did that project roll out? Man, it's really, it was just like, I was telling myself I need to get really more into the business side of things. And because I, I started doing music just for myself, I didn't make music to put out. That's why I wanted to ask you about that too. We'll get into that. But I started, you feel me, just getting it in. Like, all right, you know what? If I'm going to do this, I'm going to start off with the shit that hit home. Relapse was something that, you feel me, people at home was going through. A lot of my family members mess with heavy drugs and shit like that. So they stopped and then relapsed again. And same, so vice versa with myself. I would try to do certain shit and then stop and then just keep doing it, even though I told myself I wasn't going to do it, which is why the first single was called Again on there, because I was a repeat of the same shit. Everybody keeps relapsing. Same cycle, bro. Facts. So 
I'm just trying to switch it up. You How's everybody I mean? right now, bro? Is the family all right? Oh, uh, yeah, everybody bro? is... I'm speaking past tense with relapse, so now everybody's on the right path, you feel me? Like, Hopefully I got they don't everybody. go on back on yeah, that relapse. Nah, 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 you got nah, nah. to make a new album, Recovery, exactly. or like Eminem or something yeah, like that, yeah, bro. <laughs> the, the, I'm going to do a sequel to all of it because it's, it's coming up nice. I had to just put the story together first. Let's talk about how you got into music, bro, because first of all, how old are you right now? 26. Okay, so you're still young, bro. You're 26. You're coming up right now. Gosh. You seem really passionate about it, bro. When did you know this was for you, bro? Because some, some people are like, yo, you know, I'm going to put a few songs out. Yo. Me, bro, like, use me as an example, bro. Like, no, nah, like, I'm trying to interview you fucking every day if I can, bro. Like, right. I'm not trying to just do drop an interview a week. Like, nah, bro, I'm trying to go, bro. I'm, I'm on green light, dog. Like, <laughs> facts, you know what I'm saying? Facts, so, like, facts. that's what I want to know about you, bro. Like, one, when did you know this was for you? And two, where are you taking it? So, I mean, I started, my first rap was 14. Okay. I mean, it was written for me by my uncles. They've been rapping. 12 years ago. Yeah. As long as I can remember, though, they've been doing music since the 1990s. They got songs from before I was born. You feel me? And my so it's cousin, a family thing, too. Yeah. My cousin is corrupt. So, like, I, I grew up around music. Like, Your I was cousin's who? Corrupt. Corrupt? Yeah, I was in I was in the Your trilogy first video. Yeah. You feel me? Off okay. The uh, My mama's side of the family, but I don't. Like I could have features with him, but I'm not taking that route. I want to get my own fan For base, sure. you know what I mean? For sure. But it took from 14 to when I hit, I say about 18, when I was really into writing for myself. You know what I mean? I was like, you know what, all right, because I'm just doing songs for me. Let me write all these songs so I actually have something to listen to. I wasn't listening in the mainstream. I didn't like the music that they was putting out. So I write to give myself something to listen to. I say when I hit 20, I started listening to my music, and then I started comparing it to the industry music, and I was like, yeah, this is what I'm going to do. I, I definitely can do this. There's no way I can't do this. I got the lyrics. I got the sound, the delivery, energy. Everything is there. There's no it's no missing it. So I just started this year taking it the actual serious part of everything. Like, I want to get straight to the business. I'm putting everything out the way it's supposed to be put out, and it's my first project. Like, I ain't never dropped no project or nothing. I was just dropping. Under the high end of label. Yeah, yeah. Okay. But no, even period. Like, I've never dropped a project as long as I've been doing music. So I told myself, like, if I'm going to drop it, it's got to be right. You know what I mean? I've been doing it this long, and they never dropped nothing but little features here and there. Facts, bro. Why not take it the right road? I like that, dog. Um... I'm sure your team's helped you out with it as well as far as the rollout of the project, bro. Facts. There's 11 tracks on it. What are the tracks right now that people are really vibing to the most? So the main tracks that people like is No Way. Okay. That's uh, thing number 10 on the You on ended the it right. You ended it right. Yeah. You know, I had to come up with a little bang because uh, I did them. The, I, that's also the first video that I dropped was No Way. No, next question, bro. Okay. So... <laughs> But uh, no way and uh, business. So them two right there is business is really the one that I I want to push because it's done by King Vay. That's the producer out of Vegas. Facts, bro. And you but, guys are gonna roll out a video for that as well. Yep. Yep. I just shot the video for that like two weeks ago. It ain't even out yet. So it's done already. Yeah, it's done. It's, it's done. It's done. It's ready to go. The rollout is ready, bro. Facts. It's all in the red carpet. Do you have producers? I know you just mentioned a producer's name. Mm -hmm. Do you have a certain producer that it's like, yo, this is my guy? Nah, uh, honestly, nah. I don't. I don't have no like set producer. I kind of just flow with the wind. Like, if I mess with you, I mess with you. If you mess with me, then let's do business. Facts. I like that, bro. How would you describe your style? I honestly can't describe my style. Other people would describe it. Is anybody like said, "Oh, you sound like this person," or like, "Oh, oh yeah, kind of remind me time. of that"? I get it. so. Kevin Gates and Kendrick Lamar is my two most. K dot. You know what I mean? Yeah, everybody say I look like K dot too. You do look like K dot. <laughs> I, I was just gonna say that. You do look like K dot. Yeah, well, I, I get. I used to uh, dress up. You know what I mean? When I have like special events going on in Vegas, I dress up, go to the strip, and get people running up to me like, "Oh my God, K dot, can you sign this?" I'm like, oh, "Nah, I'm not shit. him." Like, you got the wrong person. Bro. <laughs> That's it's, hilarious, bro. It's crazy though, but I mean. I just kind of jig with it. I, I like the attention, so Facts. I don't mind. Facts, bro. Do you uh do you hit the strip up a lot? Nah, I don't do the clubs. I don't do clubs either, bro. People think I do. I hate the clubs, bro. I just went out a few times this week. Like, I had you, but like, fuck. The, I hate the clubs. I hate the club scene. I think it's super just not, facts. not me. That's bro. just not me. I'm, I'm a studio cat. You feel me? I put me in the studio, and I, I'm going to sit there and work. You I know feel like I mean? this too, bro. Like, yo, and probably goes for the same for you, but like, I be seeing a lot of people out here, like, on social media, shit like that. Mm -hmm. But I don't go out. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, I'm a nobody in the end of the day, right? That's, that's my problem. 
I feel like I lose value when I go out because motherfuckers be seeing me then. <laughs> but when I'm not, when I'm not out, they be like, "Oh, who is that? Who the fuck yeah, is that? Yo, yeah, let me exactly. let me let me link with you, bro." Exactly. But then I would be seeing them out, and it's like, "Oh, okay, okay, no." So I feel like for real, for me, like. I don't want to go out. I don't want motherfuckers to be seeing me. Nah. You can see me in here. See me on my shit. You can see me in here, bro. And like, I feel like I lose value when I go out. So yeah. like, for real, I try not to go out and do the whole bottle thing and fuck around like that. I don't give a shit about these girls if out I'm here, bro. If I'm going out somewhere like that, I'm getting paid for it. Like, Smart, bro. And that's so that's kind of where I'm, you know, where I'm heading, bro. Like, like I said, I'm a nobody in the big scheme of things, bro. But at the same point, like. I try to, I try to, I want to lay low, bro. I want to be about Facts. my money, be about my Facts. business. That's what I'm trying to do. Be about this music, bro. Without nobody knowing who I am, like I'm gonna just pop That's up. That's definition, bro. Who is that? <laughs> That's definition. That's definition. With two ends, too. That's Facts with two ends. <laughs> Don't forget it. <laughs> Hell yeah, bro. Um, we out here changing things, man. What's the songwriting process for you like? Um, recently, you write all your own music. Yeah, I write everything I do. But recently, I haven't been writing. I just been going in and off the top, off the top, and trying to. Cause I'm, I know eventually it's gonna come that one day where I gotta. Cause I don't freestyle, but it's gonna come one day where I gotta freestyle. So I'm working on that now. You know what I mean? Hell yeah, bro. But the songs is coming out fire. Like half a relapse was freestyle. People don't even know that half a relapse. The whole half of that album was freestyle. Half a relapse is freestyle. Half bro. of that is freestyle. How long did that project take you? And there's 11 tracks on it. I'm assuming mm -hmm. you had a lot more tracks done that didn't make the cut. Oh uh, yeah, for sure. I did like 20 songs total for relapse, and then just kept picking them off. I would go on live, stream myself on live, just so people different little streaming sites. And whatever they was vibing with, I would keep. And whatever they wasn't messing with, I was taking off Scrapping the album. Out. I yeah. got that. That's a good way to do it. Just because it's like, it's for the people already. So if they vibing with it on the live, then I know that's what they're going to vibe with. If they not fucking with it on live, I don't know if I could. You can swear all the Yeah, all right, we'll bet. But <laughs> if they not messing with it on live, then I'm cutting it out. Like, all right, I know they're not already feeling it. And it's, it's 30 people right here that's right. not feeling this song. So scratch Hell, that. Hell yeah, bro. Um. Is there a hyena mafia tape coming? Yeah, there is actually. We uh, all five of you, bro. We just dropped a song, but um, we took it down just because we want we want took the, it down. we wanted to be right when we dropped because they got we got videos coming out with the whole mafia trying to pop out the right way. Yeah, we want to pop out the right way. Show the world the mafia the right mm -hmm. way. So we we all gonna drop our single tape first. Um, we do got a couple collab tapes that's already out, but. We focusing on each single artist right now, and then once we get each single artist in the right position, we're gonna all smack their head across. Hell yeah, bro! Um, I know you said you had some shows in Cali. Mm -hmm. um, twenty twenty one, you already started off with a project, like your Ash. first real project on iTunes, you know, on, on all streaming on platforms, all platforms, bro. Um, so that's big for you. Twenty twenty one's been probably your biggest year in music, actually. You had to say, yeah, which is crazy. Yeah, it is coming off a pandemic, that. bro. Yeah, exactly. Fresh off the pandemic, and we already doing shit that we're supposed to do. How did the pandemic affect your music? Um, honestly, not too much, cause I were like I said, I wasn't really going out and doing shit before that. So it was just like, all right, I'm stuck in the studio. I was already stuck in the studio. Um, this is, this is home. We're <laughs> yeah, it's home. Like, we quarantine in the studio. Exactly. That's all. It, it became like a a focus point for me. Like okay. instead of me worrying about. If I was going to go out, no, nah, I'm not. There is no going out. We in the studio. What's crazy to me, bro, is 2020 feels like yesterday in a way, you know, because of everything that's happened. Facts. I mean, we've never seen changes like this before. Like, you, no one would have, you would have never predicted this shit. Nah, no one would have. No bro. one. That you got to, people telling you what you're supposed to do, how you got to, like, You got to take a shot to go watch a baseball. I mean, come on, nah. bro. We, we ain't playing that game. We ain't doing that. I'll tell you, I ain't doing that. I'm shit. not having I it. I ain't taking no vaccine. Look, bro, I, you, could, you can give me my little test that show you that I'm negative, but as far as them shots and all that, nah, I'm good. You can miss me with that. Did you have COVID, bro? Uh, you know what? I think I had COVID back before COVID was COVID, before they even okay. knew about it. Yep. And, like, January 2020. I was dying in a corner somewhere. I promise you, like, I swear to God, I thought it was over for mm -hmm. me. And then... I had it bad, bro. Three months me. later, COVID-19. Nah. So you knew. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah, bro. It's bad, bro. Especially uh, Vegas has taken such a beating from it, bro. Like, yeah, Vegas facts. is one of my favorite places. I'm there, like, and, too much. Bro, I, I walked everywhere I go in Vegas. Like, I was foot patrolling everywhere just because I stay so close to everything. You stay and close I, to the ship? Uh, yeah, I was 10 minutes. Green Valley? Mm, uh, so nah, I was right off the Cater. Okay. So right off by the Palms, Palms gotcha. Casino. So 
everybody, George from the owner of the Palms, like they all mess with me. They know who I am. So speaking of that, bro, you recorded some music in the Palms. They got a recording yeah. studio in there, right? Yep, yep. We did business. Matter of fact, business was done in the Palms. And um we shot a little mini video, relapse was done in the Palms. But I never really uh, put that video out, so I reshot it, you know what I mean? Because right. I wanted it to look better than what it was. I saw you were uh, putting in that work in the Palms. I heard they got a pretty dope studio there. Yeah, it is really nice. It's, uh, it's worth it. If you ain't never been, I would go. I so. need to go, bro. I need to see it, bro. I want to <laughs> see the studio in Vegas, bro. It'd, yeah. be, a, it'd be a vibe. Shout out sure. to Big Boy. 97.5, they uh, hooked us up with getting in there. So That's huge, bro. Yeah. What are you most, because we're, you know, what in a week or less than a week may 1st is going to be here mm -hmm. um we're almost halfway through 2021 Facts. fuck um <laughs> it's going by way too fast it's going by way too fast bro what are you most excited about personally uh um, for the rest of the year this year i'm excited about what i what i got to give to the world like I'm really focusing on my image this year and putting a visual out for y'all to see who I really am. So, like, that's what's got me excited. I'm, you know, just kind of getting that all in the mix to make sure shit is right for y'all. I like that, bro, because a lot of these artists don't understand how important it is to roll out your stuff the proper way. Even how I do it, I think just, like, I try to roll out in a unique way. I try yeah. to market in a unique way, some, you know, somewhat. But I feel like a lot of these artists just drop to drop. They might even have a great track, and like, and they just there's no promo really behind it. There's no good visuals behind facts, it. Facts, facts. Um, I feel like as an artist, marketing's half the battle. It is. You gotta I, have the talent. I'm just learning. If you can have the though. talent and the marketing. Woo. That's where you got. That's the win right there. Then you're the locked talent in. Talent and the marketing. Not the talent. Not gonna get you nowhere. Exactly. But the marketing. Well, the talent can't. It, it's a. But the marketing is. You need to have both. It's hard. Especially in it's this. hard to try to just win off of just talent. It's, that's, that's that one in a million. See, if you, you know, know somebody, I mean? you gotta know somebody too. Yeah, facts, facts. You have. If you're gonna do it with just pure talent, you gotta know somebody it's to true. get into the game. You're not gonna do it on your own. Unless, it's rare that it happens, but it, it's possible. But it's rare. For sure. It's rare. Is there anybody right now like you're trying to you're in contact with you want to do a feature with? And I'm talking about like a name that's. Um, really relevant right now possibly or maybe not relevant maybe somebody that's just like fuck I, this guy's dope man uh, a lot of people don't really know who smooth the general is but he was a part of cali swag district smoke the general smooth the general smooth the general okay i've been talking to him lately about doing a couple projects and then i also uh i don't know the only reason i, I wasn't gonna say the game but i've been talking to the game but i don't know if it's him or Chuck. his promotion team you know what i mean so through instagram yeah yeah oh, you know man. what i mean but so it's like it's i've been hearing a, a few things about that, that. i don't yeah, want so, if you google you heard some stuff yeah I, that's that i did hear a couple things so that's why i was you know be careful yeah i ain't gonna talk shit about them bro but, nah me neither but you know you know i've been it, hearing it from a lot of different artists to be real they won't get nothing from me i could say that because <laughs> they i think he wants to put you on like a playlist and yeah unless i'm not feeling that you know what i mean i told him I, if you really want to work with me facetime man we we could talk or, you know what i mean like, and there was no facetime nah, no so, no instagram yeah bro nah. if he wants this that's what i'm trying to tell you but also um uh, av compton av so that's one person that i've been talking to lately you know what i mean okay. we've been chopping it up about doing some work i just gotta really get in get in his head you know what i mean showing that i'm serious and he gonna see after this <laughs> how important is it for you to have guys like az's finest behind you um the hyenas behind you Oh, that's a big thing for me, cause that's what keep me going. Just to know that there's people out there that really mess with me the way that they do, that's gonna keep me rocking and show me like, all right, I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing. And if I'm not, they think I am. You know what I mean? So it's just motivation for me. Okay. Um, are you willing to work with other artists too? Like, if, are you? And I don't know what you're charging. If you're charging for features or what the deal is with that, bro. Um, it's 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 a it's a, it's a weird game. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Like, it's a hustle I mean? game, bro. Uh, I'm always down for working. I'm down to work with any and everybody. You know what I mean? But I, I do charge for features, but if I meet you and we just connect, yeah, then I'll, genuine. I'll mess around and just do a song with you just because. For sure, bro. You know what I mean? But it just depends on if you just approach me on Instagram, like, yo, what up, bro? Let me get a song with you. All right, 250. That's <laughs> what it is, bro. Easy. That's for facts. Sure. For sure. Good. I, I feel that, bro. If there's an artist, let's let's do this. Growing up, who was the artist you were really listening to? Because you're from Cali, bro, so it's. Um, really, like, on the day-to-day, -day, I would probably say it was Kendrick Lamar, bro. I was listening His to name him. comes up in all my podcasts, obviously. And to be real with you, I say this every time, I'm not a fan. Nah. Isn't that fucking crazy? 
I'm not, but I understand. Here's the deal. It's not that I'm not. I think he's super talented. Yeah. His music's great. But I, I, I always say this, bro. It's like, yo, if I'm going to be a fan of you, bro, I need music, bro. And I need to be fed, bro. Like, facts, I'm hungry, facts. dog. Like, I fuck with Dirk. Because Dirk be feeding me, bro. Like, new music. He stay putting in the work. I'm getting singles left and right, bro. And some <laughs> people say, like, yo, it's better not to do it like that. Because, you know, you got, you got K-Dot who's dropping, you know, music in his history. Yeah. Um... And obviously he's not dropping it. It's not that I'm not. I hate to say that I'm not a fan of him, mm-hmm. but to be real with you, bro, like I've never sat there and like, oh my god, like right. I'm listening to K guys. <laughs> I'm like, I just that's just me. And everybody looks at me like, how you fucking crazy? Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. This one dude I never even Chance the Rapper. I never fucked with him, bro. Like I never liked his music. No, bro. see, what but is it, bro? I, I could agree with you on that one. Like I don't think he's a bad artist, but Chance the Rapper is not somebody that I was like. I don't like Chance. I don't like Chance's music, bro. Like. It is what it is, bro. Like, you know, <laughs> acid rap was an acid rapper. It was, it was cool. Nah, I'm into like his marketing is crazy. That's what his is good with him. That's that was the whole thing. The marketing is what got him and his whole fan. But like, how you make three million dollars off a of five hat? Like, right, bro. Like, it's marketing crazy. game crazy. That's <laughs> crazy, bro. Damn, you made three million off that hat? Oh, wow. What a number on it. Like, what number was on the hat? The five. He got you made the three with million? the five hat. Like, pfft. crazy. Three or five? Was it three? I had three one of the two, three of in between. I've seen three that. I've seen that for sure. <laughs> I mean, I'm from Illinois, bro. So you know, his name was obviously really relevant, especially yeah, coming up. Facts. Um, that's crazy, bro. It I might, know. it might be the three. I think it is a three on this hat, but regardless, he made some M's off it. Facts. You think K Dot's dropping a project soon? I mean, I'll listen mm, to it. Nah, I, I, I've been hoping he drop a project. He ain't dropping that. LeBron yet. just tweeted, he's like, bro, <laughs> where, the, where the hell is Kendrick, bro? In times like this, I need Kendrick, bro. Yeah, facts, but. Uh, I mean, you know what? He probably got something in store, but we'll never know. He got an album done. We'll never know. Right. He, he probably got five albums done, but he ain't dropping none of them. His come up was insane, dude. Yeah. That's why. He, he's sitting comfortable, you know what I mean? He got projects he could sit on. Him. In five years, he could drop that project and then sit for another 10 years comfortable with no problem. Like, Isn't that crazy? That's the... And make millions of dollars <laughs> doing it, too. Millions yeah, of dollars. Yeah, a whole nother level right there. Like, There's money in this, bro. It is, and I'm starting it's to real learn money, that. Bro. Like, it's all a business. I got to treat it like a business. There's real money. Are you willing to work with different companies and brands? Obviously, you see, like, I work with Bel Air. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, You got yeah. brands hitting you up? Nah, I, I, I've been trying to reach out to a certain few brands that I mess with, but I'm always willing to work with all brands, especially Vans. You know what I mean? I'm, a, I'm always sporting Vans. Like, I got a brand deal with them, and I ain't got no deal with them, but I'm steady. Facts. And that's how you should be, bro. Just keep 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 being on it, bro, because they're gonna right. see you soon, bro. And then when 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 they see you, they're gonna be like, damn, we gotta fuck with this guy, bro. We can't not fuck with him. Been fucking with y'all it's for bad years. Bad business. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? It's bad business. Yeah. Not to. Yeah. Um, for real, bro. So let everybody know right now where they can find all your music. Oh, um, you can find me everywhere right now. I'm on iTunes, Apple, Spotify. You would type in definition with two ends at the end, and you're going to see two me ends. Make sure it's two Make ends. sure you put them two, two ends. ends at the end. And I got to say this, too, because it's hard for people to find me on YouTube because YouTube got, like, these weird regulations that they do. When you type in definition with two ends, they think that you misspelling oh. what you type in. And right under the search bar, it says showing results for it. If you look on there and you click the one that's spelled right, my shit's going to pop up. So your YouTube channel's definition with two ends? Yep. Okay. And then, obviously, on the gram right now, it's Def- definition underscore get to it underscore. Okay. Like, oh, that yeah. was I've had the same Instagram for since I was Keep in it, high school. Don't you know what it. I mean? So is uh the hyenas got a gram? Yeah, hyena mafia family. We got a high, uh, Instagram. We also we do Twitch because we just starting to get into the gaming. You know what I mean? Trying to span everywhere. Give y'all even the gamers want to hear the music, so why not? Facts. Give y'all something else to do. You know oh, what yeah, I mean? Bro. But we trying to expand on all platforms. So yeah, we got Facebook, Twitter. We just made Twitter, so I'm trying to get into that. So, guys, the listeners right now who's listening who are getting to know Definition right now, you got two tracks you're performing today? Facts. Are business. They, business. And No Way off of Relapse. So we're performing two out of the 11 tracks right here live. We're going to get it trippy. We're going to turn the lights off, LEDs on. Mm. We're going to get uh, two tracks off this Relapse project. I want you guys to get comfortable with it. I want you guys to listen to it, support it. Um, if you're not a fan yet, let's see if you're going to be a fan after this. You will be. You'll be a fan. We're going to make you become a fan. Um, shout out the whole hyena movement, bro. 
Um, shout out Definition, your crew, bro. Um, I appreciate you sliding, bro. But I want to I want to hear your music now live, bro. I want to feel it. I want to hear it. I want to catch a vibe, man. bro. Um, let's get a couple tracks going, bro. Definition, bro. It's been it's been dope having you here, bro. Man, I appreciate you having me, man. I hope we can look back like you know in a year or two, and I'm like, oh man, Definition, yeah, YouTube videos. Hey, YouTube we will do because I, you know I definitely like, will be back. I'll tell you if, if the first interview will be the last. So one. I'm waiting, bro. <laughs> I've interviewed. There's like I got like 75 videos or something like that up on YouTube, and I've had a lot of other you know interviews. Mm -hmm. I'm still waiting for that one artist. That's just gonna. It's gonna happen. There's gonna Somebody's be somebody gonna that's gonna blow. Facts. And, uh, and like, hey, damn, we got the fucking interview. definition like, from the blow off the Matty Ice show. Watch so this. I want it to be <laughs> you, bro. Let's make it you, bro. Let's do it. So that way Let's we can have it. we can have uh, part two. Have you come back, bro? And then we'll Facts. be like, damn, remember we did this interview, bro? And now we here. Now like now fuck, look at us. <laughs> now we here. You know what I'm saying? We started there and we here, bro. Hey, so, I'm with that all the way. I can see the vision already. Hell yeah, bro. It's coming, bro. It's been a dope vibe, bro. I've had a really good time during this interview, dude. Man, um, I appreciate you having me, Matty. Facts, but we're gonna get to this music, bro. Right, we're some heat for y'all. Let's get it going. Let's go. Relapse is out right now. Make sure you go stream the project. We're gonna perform two tracks right now. I know business is one of what's the other one, bro? No way. No way in business right now. Off the relapse project. Which, by the way, is on all streaming platforms. It's on Apple Music. It's on Spotify. It's on Tile. It's on iTunes. Everything. You know, is it on SoundCloud too? <laughs> it's on. Uh, you know what? I don't know if it's on SoundCloud. Fuck it. No, checked. stream that shit. We but need to get paid. Know, we need to get paid. I, I am on SoundCloud. For if y'all want to go hear the music, okay. a definition before I was definition, go to SoundCloud. Okay. You gonna hear some shit. Facts, bro. <laughs> With that, let's make it a vibe, y'all. Let's make it a movie. Let's go. Hey. It's time to sip another glass of Bel Air. It's time to roll up some of that, that cookie. What you doing? We hustling, what we doing? All right, bro, we got No Way. We're going to perform it live right now on the Maddie Ice Show. It's off a of relapse. Run these numbers up. Yes, sir. Let's go, definition. Let's go, dog. <laughs> the hyena's in the building. It's the hyena way. Talk to him, bro. Talk to him. That pain like hurricane, tryna none the pain with the ISIS around my veins. That shit be flooding in again and again. I really don't understand why he keep eyeing me, keep trying me to that want me to break, that want me to cry. Blood know that I can't no way. Gotta keep moving, man. I'm sick and tired of wait. Been through so much in my life. If it wasn't for God, man, I would have been had a break. I would have been had a conversation with the man on my shoulder about breaking the bank. But I sit back and I think all of the work that I put in could possibly just go to waste. Fuck it, ain't no time for that. Gotta focus. It's on my ground, but don't think that shit's sweet If you test my niggas, just know we sliding and did my bed And now I shine, take no breaks When it comes to this music, I honestly think that I'm one of the greats Circle real small, I'll mess too many Cause frankly, these people would rather be fake And it's fucked up, my circle gets smaller Man, most of my niggas keep floating away And that blow my mind, for real I'm sorry, little shorty, I really ain't got no time to chill R.P. to the smoke, put him on his shirt He want smoke, presidential with the boy smoke Classic, what I be smashing Tragic, I'm causing havoc Bastards, better watch out for you Nigga move it cause I'm coming faster Devil keep itching my back Waiting for me to react If he can't break it and he'll break the closest one to you And that's just a fact That pain like hurricane Tryna none the pain with the ISIS around my veins That shit be flooding in again and again I really don't understand why he keep eyeing me Keep trying me to that want me to break That want me to cry Blood know that I can't That pain like hurricane Tryna none the pain with the ISIS around my veins That shit be flooding in again and again I really don't understand why he keep eyeing me keep Try me, the devil want me to break Devil want me to cry Blood know that I can't No way <laughs> No way That's no way, man It's out right now Relapse Run it up Video out also Run it up Run it up That's no way live, bro Fire, bro Beats hit Beat hits, bro Oh, um, that shit's hard Appreciate it, appreciate it. But what's the business, though, bro? What's the business, business dog? We finna get into it. Big uh, business, let's go. I'm on fellas. Big business. Lordy say, yo, stay the fuck out my business. Hey. Talk to him. Gotta get the fuck out my feelings, yo. Better stay the fuck out my business. We ain't got no time to just kick it, young nigga. I'm headed straight for the money. I'm a hustler. I, I, I'm just so about my business. I can't be fucking with you niggas. I 
just so done with you bitches Stop calling my phone, it's on airplane mode Lock myself up in the room This conversation, man, what the fuck I wanna do I need to get a plan and focus on following through This year, a hundred moves, not fucking with you over true It really ain't no benefit I had to sit down with myself and ask a couple questions Like, why the fuck you playing with this shit? You know you special first Get a bag, then triple that Ain't no time to relax, gotta stay dedicated Made a transition in my life, now I be meditating Still dealing with depression, so be off this medication Trying to ease my mind, and really just another headache Fucking up my heart, why I won't give you the time Focus on my grind, gotta make sure I stay well connected Can't deal with distractions, cause really I ain't got the patience Next one do me wrong, but really feel the right for Satan That's why I had to get the fuck out my feelings You better stay the fuck out my business We ain't got no time to just kick it Young nigga, I'm headed straight for the money, I'm a hustler I, I'm just so about my business. I can't be fucking with you niggas. I just so done with you bitches. Stop calling my phone, it's on airplane mode. Fun fact, I got a couple of bitches wanna take a nigga back. But they know we disconnected, don't get no feedback. I heard some niggas say they real, but they was really rats. I heard some bitches say they loyal, but trick off a pack. You ain't loyal to the store, just put on the act. Better quit playing with yourself, kidding, I'm all that. In the back of this lady, been listening to all black chippers and G Easy boy, the bay coming with all slaps. Who you know do it like that? I get it in and dish it out just so I could double back. Bitch, I'm a hustler, been working every day, just get this money up. No funny stuff. I cut the niggas off when they start fucking up. I had to give a demonstration on how not to lose. Long as you learn from every end, and you'll be the one to choose. I had to learn to spark the snakes and the leeches. They play it cool, look like an angel, but could be a dick. And that's why I had to get the fuck out my feelings. You better stay the fuck out my business. We ain't got no time. To just kick it, young nigga. I'm headed straight for the money. I'm a hustler. Uh, I'm just so about my business. Uh, can't be fucking with you niggas. Uh, just so done with you bitches. Stop calling my phone. It's on airplane mode. What's the business, bro? Uh, all about the business. <laughs> all about the business, bro. Those stacks, dog. Uh, yes, sir. It's all, bro. Business is all. Relapse is all right uh, now. You just heard no way. You just heard business. That's the business live on the Matty Ice Show. Yo, bro, you got two bangers right there, bro. Run it up, guys. Run it up. Run the numbers up. Relapse is out right now. ASAP. Definition with two ends on all platforms. Hit up Apple Music, like I said. Hit up Title. Hit up my guy on the gram. Let mm-hmm. him know how you're feeling his music. Tag his music. Support his music. Subscribe to his Run music. Run it all the way up. You Run heard those it. numbers up, bro. <laughs> we like those numbers, bro. We want them. We want them. Run them up, dog. Nice. Get those Appreciate numbers everybody big, bro. that's out there running it up, too. Hell yeah, bro. Um, definition, bro. I'm looking forward to seeing your career thrive. Nah. Um, looking forward to seeing you elevate, bro. Get to a big level, big business. There's no other way behind nah, it. Nah, straight to the um, business. I had to get the fuck out my feelings. Straight to the business, bro. I like that, bro. I like your team. I fuck with the hyenas, bro. Man. Um, it's all love, bro. Oh, yeah. You're going to have some more coming out here, too. Be on the lookout. You uh, Hell yeah, got bro. a few hyenas that's uh, finna come see you after this. All right, this. bro. I'm ready, to, I'm ready to see some hyenas, dog. <laughs> uh, I like that, bro. They're hungry, too. Yeah. Oh, we eating. They're hey, hungry. Man. I know. Hey, if, if there's no hyenas, bro. If they ain't hungry, you're not they on the squad. They ain't hyena on my mama. <laughs> Hell yeah, bro. Well, listen, dog. It's been super dope yeah. uh, connecting with you, bro. Um, one more time, bro. Definition with two N's underscore. Get the number two it underscore on the gram. Follow him. Follow all of his music, bro. Run it up. Again, share, support, subscribe. By the way, um, make sure you guys are following me on the gram. If you're not, Matty Ice Show. Um, subscribe to my YouTube channel and uh, hit me in the gram um, and hit my producer, the Kaleidoscope Kid, as well. With that, uh, we wrap it up, bro. It's a great episode. Great Man. interview, bro. We made history, dog. Boy, um, this is history in the making. History watch. in the making, bro. We're going to check back on this interview <laughs> five, ten years from now, bro. Well, it is going to go up still. Numbers. We need these numbers, bro. I want the numbers oh, to yeah, go up. Oh, yeah, we're going to have the numbers for sure because I'm doing all and everything I need to do for this. I'm big trying to business. Get it all the way out. Big business, business is booming, like AB would say. Look, look, big business. <laughs> big I like business, that. Bro. Big yeah. business. Big hyena <laughs> business, dog. Facts. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, bro. Yo, we did it, bro. We brought the hyena in, dog. Mm-hmm. We out. It's time to sip another glass of Bel Air. It's time to roll up some of that, that cookie. What you doing? We hustling what we doing. We grinding what we doing.